Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the town of River Donk with Lost Hope and Moose. <laughs> I'm going to forget that every time. <laughs> you're just going to be like one of those, like, not goldfish, but you're just be like, aha, I did that. That's freaking rude. Is it? You're calling me a goldfish. Not like the mean way, but in like the pleasant way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but yeah, we're back with Sea Skylines, uh, back trying to build out this town. Somehow we've made money. Like, we're in severe debt. I don't know what planet you're in. But I mean, like... Yeah, but you're also paying, like, off two loans. Yeah, I guess. And we still need our freaking high street shopping. Mmm, we do. And I think that's probably gonna be what we should build next. Like, get, like, a dual carriageway in there. Not enough money. Ooh, it is a bit pricey for that. But yeah, let's try and work out how to build out the shopping center. How do you want to look? Because I think... Well, I usually literally put a high street. What, just like one road? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so like... Like here, for now? Sure. We can we can slide build out over time. There we go. We're in debt. Okay. That'll be fine. So then we'll just do this and this. Sure. And we can make this little area like a little shopping area. I accept. We can call it coin purse. Purse strings. Purse strings. Because that's where you're going to get all your purse strings cut. That's where everyone's going to steal your dollars. They're going to barricade what, you from your money. They're going to wall you in with their great prices. <laughs> Stop. Oh, come on. You can't. Wait, where is it? Where is it? There's no water. <gasps> what the? There we go. Okay, where is it? This place. So what we want to do is get this. Let's remove all this bit, right? And then just do this. I'm going to call it wool. No, purse string. Purse string? Purse strings. There we go. Cool. So now we're kind of getting there. It's looking a little bit nicer. I mean, we're starting, like, slowly starting to build everything out, like... A historical building. <laughs> so it can still level up, but it will just look the same? F off. I, I mean, didn't say anything wrong. I mean, it's kind of good though, and you can also increase your budget for like schools and stuff. Um, eventually, you can get public transport, so you can get like bus lane stuff, which I think is really cool. So you can start doing like. That the was the one thing that always screwed with me whenever I played Sim City was all the ah! bus strings and. Excuse me, public transport. <laughs> I'm just experiencing Look, the I'm demons. Permanently tired. So. Yeah, but I'd say we're kind of getting there. We don't have that much. What do you call it? We don't Money. have that much commercial stuff. I guess we can kind of build it a bit more. Let's try and do this. Uh, okay, so... What I might do is, like, make a big turn-off. So that way it kind of, like, splits the area. Because I'd say, like, we're kind of in, like, a nice little happy zone with this, wouldn't sure. you say? We uh, have no money. I don't know, but I'm just going to, like... Start building it out now. There we go. And then we can also make this, like... What we'll do is we'll grab this, right? We mm, need a thousand. Alright, we'll give it some time. Let's speed up a bit. And hopefully we can start making some big big chunk change. <laughs> here we go. Grab this, pull this out here. And we can make this like a little shopping area. Which I think is working, wouldn't you say? Yeah, but now we have our residential good demand. Do we? Oh, we do. Well, this could be like our city living. And it could be our city skyline. <gasps> I see what you did there. I know. It's quite good. Um, <laughs> that one place that isn't watered. Why mm. did you put it at an angle? Because you don't see the pipes. Oh my god, you hate me. <laughs> Your mild OCD is acting up. Uh, oh. And then maybe we should just connect these two as well. There we go. So we kind of made like an off-ramp on ramp. Cool. So now we've got this going to... Do you want to do it to here? It's all going to be even. Okay, so there. And then what we can do... Have that connect across to there. And then have some more little lines going across. Yeah, maybe not as many. So maybe like every second one? Yeah. Do you get things like mansions in this game? Uh, I don't know if you get mansions. But I can imagine you probably get like big chunky buildings at some point or another. And then we can have this. We need residential. 
Okay, well, I mean, we'll just do this, and then we'll get some, like, get the residential stuff here. Because I'd say we're kind of, like, building it out now, and then we'll make this residential as well. There we go. Uh, no. What's going on? This is the most dramatic music. <laughs> it's almost like Harry Potter-esque. It's kind of like Back to the Future. Uh, abandoned. But why? Okay, everything needs to slow down. Why are people abandoning their buildings? Low density, but no one's explaining why. Sim City, they tell you why. Yeah. Mm, okay. <laughs> Maybe it's because like people are just like we want we want more stuff to build. I don't know. What's the saying? Not enough educated workers. Okay, so I guess it's education is part of the issue. Because ah uh, yeah, I see. 10k. Okay, let's speed this up a bit. Um, do you want a community college or a high school? Well, you can't just go from elementary school to community college. So, do another high school like here? Wait, another? We have elementary. Uh, only teenagers can attend this, but I think we need another high school. No, cause it's we, only, we don't even have a high school, we no, just have elementary. No, I mean, I think we need another elementary because it's almost that capacity. Yeah, but we need high school because then that's who's hiring these people. Okay, so let's hope we can get some money in for that. It's 24k. How are we doing for loans? <laughs> we can pay it back and then take one out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, we're actually making a lot more money now, so I think we should be okay. Yeah. So let's weigh it out. Um, People are complaining about the garbage. Really? There we go. 12% full, 15 garbage trucks in use. Okay, so that's fine. Relocate, empty buildings for another facility, open budget panel. Okay, so we should have some more stuff coming through. Okay, so we're not having enough educated workers. Crap. Uh, education, education, education. You can't do a lot with just an elementary school diploma. No, you could not. So we need eleven more K. I say we take up the loan. Cause at least then we can kind of like get it set up, get our education in there, and then no one has to really stress out too much. So where, do you, where, where should we put this? Here? Sure. Okay. And then hopefully that kind of fixes our problems for now. Um, get rid of this, get rid of this, remove that, and then we should kind of be good for a while. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. And then the whole education thing's starting to fade away and everyone's a bit more intelligent. Uh, new fire stuff, no. I think we should be okay. Yeah, it looks like we're kind of getting there now with our new education. Um, and then elementary school, how are we doing with that? Capacity's almost full, so Apparently I think... Apparently they want parks. Oh, okay. Uh, what could do? Parks, parks, parks. Uh... Oh my god, where could we put these? Okay, that fixed a lot of issues. Um, and then maybe... Put one... In the small plot of land. Like this one? Or this one? No, like the tiny one. Okay, never mind. It didn't fit. That, that was the issue. Oh. Um, cool. Then we got some more stuff going up. Uh, maybe put one in West Side as well. Or just uh, maybe here. No, West Side's too small. Leave it. <laughs> Leave it to suffer. Uh, what about here? I don't think we're okay with. Okay, never mind. Ooh. I'm trying to like make sure everyone's like kind of sorted out still. Uh, we. What's this? We want not enough workers. Yeah, the residential demand is quite high. Okay, so... I think... What do you want to do then? Get some more double roads in? Well, we need more residential areas. Okay, so let's do this. Okay. <laughs> um... <clears throat>
With negative three dollars. Uh, okay. Uh, let's try and get taken over again. So more residential, more residential. So for these sorts of games, right? Like the city skyline esque ones, the um, don't know what you could call it. these city building ones. Do you prefer these to the likes of um, architects and like architects and stuff, or would you? Is it like a? Is oh my like god, don't! They hold different spaces in my heart. Okay, so but if you had a if you had a preference for one. Ugh. Come on, everyone has like a preference. I don't. They fulfill different needs. Sometimes they wake up and I'm just like, I want to build a city and destroy it. And then there are other times where I'm like, I want to build a theme park and specifically pick people up who give me bad reviews and drop them in the ocean. <laughs> like, there's two different moods. Okay. Predominantly, what oh. mood are you in? Probably Sim City, if I had to pick one. If you had to pick one, okay. Because it's just more enjoyable, or um, I'm gonna go with the fact that like, it's just what's on my computer. That's fair. There we go. And then power roll still kind of sorted, which is good. Cool. And then we're still making like, hey, Boomtown. We can now get buses and transport. We need money first. Recreation is. And then you get like intersections Ooh. and roundabouts and all that sort of stuff, which is kind of nifty. But yeah, it's quite a fun little game. Um, so I think what should probably be like a last thing to do is get a bus route set up, honestly. You know? Yeah. So where should we get this bus route set up? Let's pause it for a sec and I'll just wipe out this building. Where should we get this bus up? Bus stop. Do you have preference where you want it? Well, they can kind of walk over there where right now. But there's like a perfect space right here. Okay, fine. Okay, so. Uh, that's that. So where do you want these bus lines? It should go to all the schools because education is important. Okay, so. Hmm. Okay, we should have one going like into the center of town and then going to How crazy is this? It's a little weird. It's cool, right? Because you can like really hammer up so we can have it go in a circle. Yeah, we can have like literally go in like a lice big circle. A lice? A lice big circle, yeah. Um, there we go. And then we can have another one that kind of goes It needs to go to west side and east side. Well, yeah. But what we could do is do like a big route, kind of takes you down to uh, purse strings, and then kind of just takes you through Why is it there. Called Glade Hills. I don't know. I think I have to rechange that name, and then we can just have it connect back up. There we go. And then we can have one just going around west side. There we go. And then one going around east side. And then there's supposed to be like a connecting one. If that makes sense at all. Uh, so back here and then... There's no road, that's why. <laughs> ah. Okay. So we complete and then we'll have one that goes from like here to there. Kind of like runs through the town. And then it can kind of take you down here. So you can go do your shopping, and then it can take you back to... Where's the start? There we go. Cool. Let's see how that does. Hong Kong buses. There we go. And then we got, like, there you go. That's a truck. That's a bus. And you can see what line details is. You can see how much like money it makes as well. So like if I click off here. Tells you how many vehicles it has for that line. I like the hot dog And you can van. also change the color. Nah man, I like the hot dog van. Oh really? You're trying to make London buses. Yeah. And then you can also have line activity like during the day and during the night and all that sort of stuff. Mm. Like for instance, so 
purple. That's pink. Is it? That's fuchsia. Oh, that's the color it should be. And then all the buses in that line would be that color as well. Which I think is pretty cool. I see, we're kind of getting there with our little town of Riverdonk. But yeah, I think we've got our buses. You've got little purple buses chugging along here now, taking everyone around. We've got our blue ones, and then look, a little donut van as well. I like the hot dog man. The hot dog van? Van, man. What's that? Is that here? I don't know. I saw him running around. And then there's kids in the playground. Which is quite funny because you can have a look at everyone's name. Educated teen. Educated teen playing in the playground. But yeah, it's quite a nice little town we've got here so far. Um, at some point we should try and like buy onto like maybe here or here, make it a little bit more industrial. But yeah, we can always see and kind of explore and go with it. But yeah, I think that's where we're going to call it for now. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Uh, I'm hopefully you guys are enjoying like Riverdunk and its inhabitants. We're going to try and build out into like a full fledged little city with our little Poopsville here. That will turn to like Turdsville later on. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, we'll try and move on from there. We're making some decent dollar and we've got a moose with us, so life is good. So thank you so much. Oh, for I just got it. Yeah, and then there's the Illuminati when you get to 80,000. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, guys, and we'll see you on the next episode of City Skylines Riverdonk. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>